वेलकम फ्रेंड्स हियर इज द थर्ड पार्ट ऑफ क्वेश्चन नंबर वन ऑफ एक्सरसाइज टू पॉइंट टू ऑफ चैप्टर टू एंड द क्वेश्चन से इज फाइन द जीरोज ऑफ द फॉलोइंग क्वाडिटिक पॉलिनोमियल एंड वेरीफाई द रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन द जीरोज एंड द कॉफिशियंथ देर फोर दिस इज द पॉलिनोमियल एंड वी शेल कलेक्ट द पॉलिनोमियल दैट इज सिक्स एक्स स्क्वेयर एंड वी शेल लाइट इट इन इट्स स्टैंडर्ड फॉर्म then we shall write the term of x square then term of x then term of constant term and we shall denote it by px because the variable is x and now we shall factorize this polynomial by using middle term splitting method and then it will be minus 9x plus 2x minus 3 here we have 6x square we split the given middle term in such a way that the sum of its two factors is equals to the middle term itself but the product of the two factors is equals to the product of first term and last term and now we shall take 3x common from first two term then we have 2x minus 3 and here we shall take common 1 then we have 2x minus 3 in bracket here we have 2x minus 3. Here we have 3x plus 1. And now we shall put it px equals to 0. This means we have 2x minus 3 into 3x plus 1 equals to 0. Here we have 2x minus 3 equals to 0 or 3x plus 1 equals to 0. This means we have x equals to three over two, or x equals to minus one over three. So these are the two zeros of the given polynomial. This means at these two points, the graph of the polynomial intersect x-axis. And now we shall verify the relationship between the zeros and the coefficients. Here we have a verification. and in verification first of all we shall find the sum of zeros and sum of zeros is 3 over 2 plus minus 1 over 3 this means here we have 6 here we have 9 here we have minus 2 if we add these two rational numbers then we have 7 over 6 and we can write it as minus into minus 7 over 6 and this ratio is equals to minus coefficient of x over coefficient of x square so this relationship is verified and now we shall move to the product of zeros 3 over 2 into minus 1 over 3 this means we have minus 1 over 2 and we can write it as minus 3 over 6 and this ratio is equals to constant term over coefficient of x square so this is the solution of the question thank you